Hey, first grade, let's get ready for foundations. The materials you're going to need at home are a red crayon, a notebook, and a pencil. The materials at school you will need are a pencil, a red crayon, your dry erase board, and a tile board. Today's objective is I can identify long E words and words with closed syllables. Let's review our trick words of the week. Says and say. You are going to practice your trick words on in your assignment today. You're going to put the trick words in sentences and write them in the letter boxes. Now let's get ready to echo. Remember, when you see echo the owl, you repeat after me. A, apple, a. B, bat, b. C, cat, D, dog, d. E, ed, e. F, fun, f. G, game, g. H, hat, h. I, itch, i. J, jug, j. K, kite, k. L, lamp, l. M, man, m. N, nut, n. O, octopus, a. Ah. P, pan, p. Q, U, queen, qu. R, rat, er. S, snake, s. T, top, t. U, up, a. Uh. V, van, v. W, wind, w. X, fox, x. Y, yellow, y. Z, zebra, z. W, H, whistle, w. C H chin ch. S H ship sh. T H thumb. C K sock. K. A L L ball all. A M ham am. A N fan an S bugs z A N G fang ang I N G ring ing O N G song ong U N G lung ung a N K bank ank I N K pink ink O N K honk onk U N K junk unk A R car R O R horn or I R bird er E R her er U R burn er Great job. Now let's pause the video and stretch our vowel sounds. 
we are going to learn three new vowel teams today. All of these vowel teams we will learn say we'll say e as a long vowel sound. So repeat after me. E e jeep e. E a eat e. E y key e. Now remember, when two vowels go walking, the first one does the talking, and the second one does the walking. So remember, the first vowel says its own name, and the second vowel goes walking. So let's practice our word of the day. So we'll need our dry erase boards and a notebook. How do you tap out the word act? Act, act. Good. How many letters in the word act? Three. How many sounds? Also three. How can we write it on the writing grid? This is what act should look like on your writing grid. Now, how do you mark it? We're going to mark our blend, CT. We are going to scoop it with a C underneath to show that it is a closed syllable word. And we would put the smile on top, which I think I forgot to do, and I apologize for that. So what is the vowel sound? Ah. And what does the word act mean? When you're pretending to be something, you're acting. So remember, what is a closed syllable? A closed syllable has only one vowel, the vowel is short, and the vowel is followed by one or more consonants closed in. So let's go on a closed syllable hunt. Let's read the word. We're going to mark the closed syllables. Put an X over it if it's not a closed syllable. So if it is a closed syllable, I want you to use your dry erase boards to try and mark it. So let's look at the first word, we. Is we a closed syllable? Does it have a short vowel sound? Nope. And cross that out. Let's look at the word trim. Is trim a closed syllable? Yes, it is. It is a closed syllable because it has a short vowel sound followed by a consonant. And this is how we would mark a closed syllable. Now, bite. Bite is not a closed syllable. It has that long I sound. Even though it has, it's followed by a consonant, it says a long vowel sound. So that is not a closed syllable. Foam. Again, not a closed syllable. The vowel is not short. Wept. Yep, wept is a closed syllable. Has a short E sound, and it's followed by a consonant letter. Look, it's not a closed syllable. The double O makes it not a short vowel sound. Fun, that is a closed syllable. We have the short U followed by a consonant letter. Shrug, that is a closed syllable. Short U followed by a consonant sound. Good job, male. Nope, not a closed syllable. A-I says A. Small. It is a closed syllable. The A is short, followed by two consonant letters. Jeep. Not a closed syllable. That E-E -E says that long E sound. We just learned that sound today. And net. Net is a closed syllable. Short E sound followed by a consonant letter. Now you're going to try this all on your own. Have a wonderful day.